Thoughts on feminism? I'm sick of the feminist misandry on this app. Y'all claim to hate men and want to be independent bitches until there's a military draft. Or a spider. Or an unopened water bottle. Yeah, until we have to go to war or until someone breaks in the house and we have to go downstairs and fight them off. Or when women want to settle down, get married, buy a house, but they don't want to go halves on any of it. More or less, when protecting and providing comes into the equation, then that modern day feminism goes out the window. If you got drafted to go to World War III, would you go? For my brother, I would. Yeah? I'd be scared as fuck, but I would. Stop the cap. <laughs> there you go. Okay, we're looking for volunteers to go. Oh, fuck no! I think men are better than women. She's kidding. No, I'm not. They provide for us, and we must obey them because they are our masters. And I think the war in Ukraine's really solidified that once again. It wasn't the men that were allowed to leave the country for their safety. It was the women and the kids. Even the old men had to stay and fight. Well, Mika, we've been here for a few hours now, and we've seen a steady flow of women and children arriving from Ukraine. And we're seeing women and children uh, walking down this pathway, just crossing into Poland. But what you don't see are men crossing into Poland, and that's because uh, Ukraine has said that uh, men from ages 18 to 60 cannot leave the country. Men have always and still do fight for the lives of women and children. We put more value on their lives. We literally go to war and die for you. Most men are low in testosterone. Most men are operating out of their feminine more than they are their masculine. Men were men until women bitched about men being men. Most women aren't gonna like this, but if you stop complaining about the way men do things and men bringing in income and men opening doors and men doing things that men are supposed to do, maybe they would be men. Worked Sunday, put money on the table. This is my girlfriend, she's mentally unstable. <laughs> you lazy bastard, look at the state of you. Hey, we'll give her a break because it's a Sunday, but if she ain't doing shit from Monday to Friday, then you know where she belongs. She belongs to the streets. What is the male equivalent of having an enormous shower, shaving every inch of your body? A two minute wink and a cup of tea. Next question, please. Can I help you with something? No, you're all right. What are you doing? Just wondering why you have a 2014 when you're begging for change all over the city of Richmond. You're why on. Don't you leave me alone. You're but. You're viral. You're on Facebook. You're the talk of the town this morning. What would you like to say to everybody in Richmond? You know what? That's it. How much did you make today? How much is in that bag? I'm calling the cops on you right Good. now. Good. You better get me off your cell phone. Everyone, be warned. How do you feel about this? These people will leave me alone. Can you tell me what's Why are they taking pictures of me and my wife? We have a right. This is a free country. Well, We're not. Did you know that she parks in your parking lot every day and has never spent a dollar here and begs for change? It's on NBC 12 on Facebook. This, this is going to go viral. It already is viral. So why are y'all doing this? Because it's wrong. You're taking people's money. You have a clear car. What year is that? It's wrong. What year is that vehicle? What is he talking about? How much money? Where do you live? What's he talking about? It's You're wrong. begging what's for money. Yeah. What, what do you have? What, what's the problem do you have with me? Because Stop stealing gonna, people's money. Stop begging for money. You own a car. Kind of you You're not homeless. Some people are really okay. homeless. Some people are really homeless okay, and need so help. Do you think that people have to stand out here because they're homeless? What? Your sign says you're homeless. But it's why I never give money to homeless people. I'd rather give them food or I give them some clothes. Someone they can actually keep. If they refuse that, it's a bit suspicious to me. It's either they probably want to get some drugs or they're scamming you. Getting gonorrhea is not really different from getting like strep throat or something like that. Shut the f <laughs> man, what? <laughs> man. Stop it. Get some help. You know your girlfriend is comfortable around you when. She starts dressing like Adam Sandler. <laughs> Man, that is fucking accurate, though. Have you seen Adam Sandler playing basketball? It looks exactly like him. Look at this. Fucking twins, bruv. Somebody's just got proposed to on the tube. That's so beautiful. What a violation. That's not all right. Oh, I'm so happy for you. I'd be fuming if that were me. When you desperately want to tell your boyfriend that his mate's trouser snake looks huge in his shorts. Someone said in the comments, 5 out of 10s are the most dangerous, I swear. They have all the courage of the 10s. 
They're getting too comfortable. Now, I'd assume she's joking, and I'm not saying she's a 5 out of 10, but he's not wrong in that comment at all. Social media's got a lot of average women thinking they're 10s, and it's not just social media, it's also The Sims validating them, going in their DMs, making them think they're the best thing since sliced bread, when they're not. Decent looking guy's got to work for a girl, he's got to show he's got a bit of game. An unattractive woman just got to put it on the plate, and someone's going to take it. My line in college was, Hey, I'm trying to sleep with everyone on my dorm floor. Do you want to go back to my place? Did and that it work? Worked. <laughs> oh my god. Holy shit. And this has proven my last point, and I'm not trying to be horrible, I'm not saying she's really unattractive or whatever, but she's not exactly Jessica Alba, is she? There's no way this line or behaviour would work for the male equivalent of her. If anything, it'd probably been kicked off campus for that shit. Trash ass fit, bro. Why are you wearing stripes with a checkered flannel and high waters with no socks? And Osiris Lowe's. You're a victim. Mm. And day my baby daddy come here with one fucking meal for my child. But I have three other kids. We have one kid together, but he only want to come and bring one thing at McDonald's. But what about my other kids? How come you can't feed my other kids at McDonald's though? Like that's bogus as hell. Like you're not finna sit here and make my other kids feel left out. And you're only bringing one child something to eat look there he go and i bet you he only got one thing in there i bet you he don't even i'm finna expose the out of him so people can see how he really is what's up because i'm finna expose you what? because that don't look that don't look enough for all my kids that don't look enough for all my kids what is that that's just one burger one burger one fry what he like what do you mean you know i don't get my food stamps to the seven but if you're trying to help out, though, you're I'm not helping not, out. I'm not trying to help. I'm trying to help my son. My but son. how are you helping your son when you're only getting care for, food for just him and not the other kids, his siblings? Lisa, you have Them to, are his siblings, Lisa, though. He's not finna eat in front of all his other siblings and they're you're not eating on McDonald's. Out. You might have already seen that woman because she went viral for the completely wrong reasons. She tried to expose her baby daddy and she exposed herself. I can't believe I've even got to say this, but them other kids are not his responsibility. His own kid should be his focus and his responsibility, and it sounds like that's what he's doing. Kids that you had with other men are nothing to do with him. He shouldn't have to buy them food. Their dads can buy them food. I'm married. That's what's relevant to me. That's what's relevant to you? Yeah. When did, when did you get married? Uh, approximately three and a half years ago almost four years ago what would you rate me on a scale from one to ten like hotness everything overall overall hold on he's a ten can i get a kiss on the cheek she ain't really acting like a married woman in my opinion, bruv. And the reason why I'm saying that is because do you really think she'd be acting like that if her husband was right next to her? I don't think so. You can tell she's a bit drunk, but that's still no excuse. If I was a husband and I saw that clip, I'd be getting a divorce quick time. I ain't gonna lie. Maybe I'm being a bit harsh, but I think there's only one place she belongs. She belongs to the streets.